To start with, the user is asked to choose the kind of website that he wants to create. That is A, a graphic-rich website, or B, a content-rich website. I now choose the graphic-rich option for the sake of the demo. Now, the user can choose a design category that is most suited to his line of business. A wide range of design categories are available for him to choose from. Now, let's try and create a website for a typical small business, like a, a fast food joint, for instance. I would then choose the service business category. Next, the user can choose a design that he likes to have as his home page. There are several pages of designs available. Let's pick something that has some food on it for our fast food website. Something like this, for instance. The user can, of course, change this to any of the hundreds of designs at a later time. Once the design is chosen, the user can customize the design by simply clicking on the color and image options available. Suppose I was selling milkshakes instead of puddings or burgers, I can then replace this main image with my own custom image of a nice healthy milkshake. Now, the user can add the basic details to his website, such as the company name, slogan, and email address. Next, the user can add pages to his website. The user can either just click on a page name and add it to his website, or add his own custom page name by simply typing it in. Now, the user can preview what he's created so far. Now, imagine you're running this burger joint. In less than five minutes, you just created a complete website with your own company name, your slogan, your email address, all the pages that you wanted to have on your website, in your choice of design template. Now, all you have to do is just replace the sample text with your own custom content to make the website complete. Once the user accepts the design, he is then taken to the page manager. The page manager allows the user to completely manage all aspects of his website. It allows the user to add new pages rename pages, rearrange the order of the pages, add sub-navigations, etc. The user can also edit existing pages, change the page type, or even delete them. Anytime the user is not sure what to do next, he can simply click on the Help Movie link, which is available on every single page. Clicking this link, a flash movie plays, showing him exactly what he can do on the page, what he can do next, and so on. Help for users is always just one click away. Now let's take a look at one of the most frequently used features in any site building tool, which is adding content to a text page. What you see now is the feature rich WYSIWYG editor, preloaded with some sample content. Using this editor is pretty much like using Microsoft Word. Now the user can start typing in the content afresh, or simply copy and paste the content from elsewhere, just like most users do. This powerful editor allows these users to simply copy and paste their content, do some basic formatting, and then quickly publish it to their website. The beauty of the tool is that the entire formatting is fully preserved during the copy and paste operation. The user can now further format the content or add tables, insert images, apply style sheets, etc. Now let's hit the submit button to preview the text page, just as it would appear on the live website. And here is a professional looking text page that we have created in just a couple of minutes.